Hello guys, in today's video we'll see how to use variables and buttons to filter some dimensions. So let's say that we want to filter only those states, in this case we have the states right here, they are above 100k. We change the variable value and by clicking on this button, we'll filter only those states where we have the value greater than this variable. If I change the variable again to 300k, I can click again and it will filter even further. The first step is to create a variable. I will call it vthreshold and give it a value of 0. I will add a KPI just to see the variable value. And using the custom objects, I will use the variable input object. With this object, we can change the variable value. So here in the appearance section, we'll select the variable, which is V threshold. And this could be an input box, a button, a drop down list, or a slider. I will just leave it like that. And now I will add a button. Let me change the label to filter states. And in this button, we'll define an action. So every time we click it, something will happen. So let's add here an action. Here in this drop down list, let's find the selected values in the field. Our field to be selected is the state. So we'll find here state. And the value will be the expression that will define which states should be selected. So for that, we'll use the concat function with a distinct, our column in state, and semicolon to separate the values. If we just do it like that, we'll select all states. So just to show you the example, if I click here, all states will be selected. But we want to use the variable as a threshold to select those states that are above certain values, right? So first, let me change this to 300,000. In this chart, I will add a reference line. And now in the button, in our concat function, we'll add a set analysis. Here we'll add the expression to filter the states, where the sum of planet area is greater than the variable value. And for that, we need to add double quotes equals sum of value. Here in this example, this is my column. And this should be greater than the variable. We can check here in the expression that the variable was solved. And we can check the value. Now if I hit apply, now only those states with the value above 300k are selected. If I change this value to 500k and click again, I will filter only above this threshold line. And if you wish to visualize in the expression editor which states would be filtered, we can click here come to the expression and before everything we'll add single quotes dollar sign open parenthesis equal sign and after the expression we close parenthesis and close it again with single quotes we'll see down here that the expression is solved showing us the values that would be filtered in that field but this is just to demonstrate how click would solve the expression so that's it for this video if you like this kind of content subscribe to the channel and see you in the next one